Yo, yo, Daily Fire, episode 337. If it's trash, turn it off. But if it has value, please share it out for me. Of course, it's brought to you by MaxEffortMuscle.com. For all your supplement needs, go to Max Effort Muscle. All right, Daily Fire, episode 337. Establish New Habits 101. So, obviously, there's the book uh, Atomic Habits from James Clear that is wildly popular. Sold like 5 million copies. If you haven't got it, I would recommend it. He's a Columbus guy, so I definitely want to rep James Clear. These are things that I heard him recite and talk about um, on the Ed Milet Show, but are also things that I have followed for a really long time and I've told, told my clients to follow. And it's like, when you want to create new habits... It feels like this huge mountain that you got to climb. But the reality is I would just pick some real basic items that you believe that you could do on a regular basis, build on, and then elaborate on. So like, for instance, maybe it's walking 10 minutes. You know, I, I literally talked to my mom about walking a mile a day for 100 days, and she thought it was one of the coolest things that she had done just because there was like probably... 20% of the days she would have missed, she didn't miss because she had a streak. And you could see the psychology working on someone that I grew up with that we had never really talked about those things before. She sees me talk about them and write about them and all these things. But when she engaged in it, she felt exactly what the difference was. And so what is thing that you, what is the thing or multiple things that you think you can do for one day? Then think about, but could I do them for seven days? And then if you can get to 21 days, that's where things start to stick in my opinion. It takes about 21 days to create a habit. Once you get to 30 days, that's when it feels like a streak because now you're at a month. So like my best advice would be get to that 30 days, but make each one of these days like mile, like mini milestones and then you start to take pride in not breaking it, and then it becomes a momentum builder. So, for instance, I want to walk 15 minutes and listen to an audiobook. I'm going to do that for one day because I got up a little bit early, and I want to get up 15 minutes earlier, and I'm going to apply that, that time to myself. Man, I feel good today. You know what? I feel good today. I'm going to do it tomorrow. And I'm going to do it tomorrow no matter what. Like, I'm going to get it in. So then now you strung a week together and you realize my combined feeling is better because I'm taking time for myself. Then, you know, you, you make it to three weeks, 21 days. And you're like, man, this is just part of my life now. And then you start to become prideful on it, man. I'm going to get to a month. And if you can get to a month, why can you not get to a year? And you start to really become like prideful on not breaking it. It becomes a no matter what mentality. It's like, I don't care if I flew in here or flew in there or got up late or got up early or had this baby shower to go to or had my cousin's graduation. It doesn't matter. You still get it in because the momentum of the streak is like really gratifying. It's you're prideful on it and you are getting better 100%. So now you get the 30 days, 60 days, 90 days, a year, whatever that is, and then you start to add up the compound effect of literally, I'm going to get my little calculator out right here, uh, what would it be, 0.15, right, because that would be 15 times 365, I think that's how I do it, maybe not, maybe that's not right. How do you figure out 15 minutes a day for 365 days? No, I don't think that's it, is it? It'd be minutes. Okay, then you go in, in hours, right? 15 times 365 is 5,400, and then divide that by 60, right? That would give me an hour because that's minutes. Yeah, 91 hours. Yeah! Geometry is a senior, motherfuckers. <laughs> I know. That's what I'm saying is my math is elite, Kyle. That's why you missed the point. All right, 91 hours. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I didn't need it. Not listen, you know what math is elite. If you put plates on the bar, I have it memorized. It's all matters. Two plates, Cole. What is it? See? Genius. <laughs> Danny. Da hey, Danny, three plates and a quarter. Hey. I've seen him deadlift out before. All right. 
<laughs> anyway, 91 hours. So my point is, then you think about that, like, I spent 15 minutes a day, and I got 91 hours smarter. That's a lot of, that's a lot of hours, bro. That's a long, that's a long time. And then you can apply other things to it. So establish a new habit 101. This was one of the most basic ones I could think about. Get up 15 minutes early, literally walk and listen to some for 15 minutes a day and let that just marinate on how much different that could make in a year's time. But you got to do it for one day, 7, 21, 30, and then go from there. All right. Daily Fire episode 337, establish new habits. 101, we are out.